Well, hello everyone. So it does look a little bit better. Uh, I've cleared out quite a bit of stuff. Uh, all that's uh, trash. I got three doors and then this piece of wood right here is going back to the shop. Everything else is pretty much trash. Um, I got an idea for this. I found a whole bunch of hooks and interconnectors. It's uh, basically grid square. So I'm gonna make me a little mini, uh, kind of like a little display where I can hang stuff from it, put it on wheels. So uh, I got something I'm gonna put on it. Eh, it may work, it may not, I don't know. But anyways, that's done. And then all these trash cans are full. And all this stuff here is stuff that's ready to sell. So, all this is stuff that I'm just going to put right on the shelves at the uh, warehouse. So, uh, but three trash cans full of trash. Well, actually four. That one's almost full. So, I'm going to go through, finish up. And I've been here. I got here about 12. Uh, how long have I been here? Yeah, so about three hours working on this uh, unit. And there's still a lot more stuff, but I couldn't find a uh, place in the truck to put it. So most of this stuff here on this side is all going to be for sale. Um, and then this stuff is kind of sort of gone through. Um, you know, like here's a tote full of wheels where I pulled off. Um, had a bunch of dollies that got wet and got all moldy. So I just pulled the wheels off and threw the wood away. I can always, you know, rebuild them later if I have to. Basically, they're like this right here. So, in fact, I think I'm gonna pull the wheels off of that to make that that little rack system. But it's uh, I'm gonna be back over here tomorrow. I called all my customers except for one, and um, so I'm gonna come back over here and finish up going through these. I actually kind of ran out of trash cans, and I'm I haven't ate all day today, so I'm a little peckish. Um, but got a lot of stuff done all the uh, floors dried out uh the only thing if it isn't coming from the roof and it's not because we went around back, well the owner went around back and uh the only thing is this little rubber piece here was shoved over that way so you see here where it's missing uh this little section and i don't think it brought bringing that much water but this was you know like it was over there so um I don't know it just seems a little weird that that little tiny section but basically it's just a little piece here that's missing so the sad part is I think I might have to go back to Lowe's but I really oh and Lowe's called me today and say well how, how was everything picking up your order I says I never had a chance to pick up my order because no one knew how to get into the computer and find it so um, but I explained to an uh, area is ASM area service manager but I talked with them about um, what happened and everything else. And, oh, we'll get on it and get taken care of and blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, yeah, right. You know, there's not one person in there who knows what the hell's going on. So, but yeah, I'm going to go through. And uh, um, I did talk with the guy who owned Unit 3 before I did. And uh, <laughs> he told me that it leaked. So, I'm really scared on what the hell I'm about to run into on them three units. So... But I think what I'm going to do is every day that I have, I'm going to bring, um, you know, a couple trash cans or I'm just going to bring something and I'm going to come here and I'm going to work on uh, going through a couple boxes every day, regardless of morning, noon, after, uh, late at night, whatever. I'm just going to come out here and get it done. So, but what I can do is this, um, I'll probably be back tomorrow to finish up this. I'm going to bring a whole bunch of these little totes here and like what i'm doing is like this one here is just painting stuff so whenever i find painting stuff bam i put it in there this is all the little attachments from my gopro um yeah that's all dremel stuff you know and i'm just going to go through and kind of get things uh a little bit organized i have all this shelving here and all the shelving up here so i can make these smaller and i'm just going to put a bunch of these totes here and just Kind of do what I was doing at the shop, but that way as I'm going through all the stuff that's out here, nothing goes back except stuff that's ready to go back, if that makes any sense. I don't know if I'm making sense or not. So, and this morning I took all the car stereo installation kits, sold them. Uh, he wouldn't buy them before, but he bought them this time because he's been having trouble uh, getting stuff. Uh, he's like, yeah, man, I'm back ordered on like half the stuff I ordered. And I was like, well, I got all this. And 
you know, and um, I ended up getting a little more than what I've asked on previous videos. Let's just put it that way. So um, he's making a hell of a deal. He's going to make a ton of money off of it, and they're out of my way. The good thing is he said that he wants to buy the rest of everything I have, like all the wiring and everything else. So that's another thing that I'm going to start working on because uh, uh, between tomorrow and uh, maybe Monday, I want to get as much of this done and get that over there so I can get the money for that. So, and once that's done, and yeah, I'm, I'm pretty much good for December, I think. Um, yeah, as, as long as I don't buy anything, I'm I'm good for all of uh, December's rent payment. You know, for, well, not rent, but bills and everything. So, uh, as of right now, I'm not going to have to owe a bill until January 1st. And um, uh, they understood... Uh, the people here and they're going to help me out uh, they're going to give me a discount a little bit on the rent because of the water and everything else and you know that's a nice thing for them to do so i'm happy about that and but i'm just going to see what's what's going through like i said i found a bunch of stuff and stuff that i was like you know what i'm probably not ever going to get around to selling it so i just chunked the stuff so. but that's it for now uh thank you very much for watching and um <laughs> I'm going to be going through some crazy stuff here in the next couple weeks. In fact, once I get to a point where I don't need to worry about doing things to cover bills is when I start doing stupid things. So keep a lookout for that. And also, and by the way, I'm, I'm better today. I know I've been in a bad funk, you know, for a long time. And uh, I still don't want to get into what caused the funk, but it's better now. And, you know, a time has passed and time heals all. So... But that's it for now. Peace, love, money. I'm out.